Greg, welcome back. Thanks for having me back. You're Good you're on your way you. to on way to Miami later on. I am. I'll be leaving tomorrow. Uh, be part of the Bills Mafia, flocking down there, is supporting the team. And we know how much you liked the Detroit Lions trick play last week. Are you bringing anything of uh, of value to the Bills with you? The trick play for the Bills is to score one more point more than the Dolphins. <laughs> <laughs> it's a good trick. It's a good trick. All go. righty. Well, start us off. We're playing a, a line that says the Bills are favored to Miami by three and a half. Who you got? So I've been thinking long and hard about this. This reminds me of the last year's playoff game. Bills won 34-31, so that's three points. I do believe the Bills are going to win 34-31, but I want to get the points to get back so I can win. So I'm going to pick the Dolphins because they're plus three and a half. <laughs> so you're splitting a half point. <laughs> There's, There's a new leader in the clubhouse, by the way. I had to do it. Oh, wait. Is there a new leader? Who's the There's new leader? There's a new leader in the clubhouse, <laughs> but I'm not one to brag. Tariq, uh, take, a look at the, uh, take a look at the game. Three I'm, not, I'm not the leader. Um, <laughs> I will go on top of Greg's pick and say that the Miami Dolphins will win by four. Just for You're picking the, Miami. Just, for, just to see what the What Miami's face. getting. No, Miami's getting the points. I, get it. I, I understand it. I, I believe. So you'll be I winning believe, by seven and a half. I believe that it will be that big of a game for Miami. Wow. They will go in. It will be of no <laughs> concern of the point spread. Four points doesn't matter. Seven all they get doesn't matter. Miami wins the game. Okay, thank you to both of you because Buffalo's going to win this game by three and a half. I'm just, I'm wet. I mean, Bill's going to stumble. I just won this the court segment for this in the season. NFL? I didn't know that. Look, <laughs> The bottom line is this. Uh, last season, the Bills lose the opening game. They win on a walk-off field goal with Tyler Bass, and then you have the three-point playoff game. The Bills blew them out in Orchard Park opening. I don't see this game being as close. Plus, you have, as we talked about earlier, the massive injuries with Miami. They're not going to be able to rush the passer. The Bills win. I see them by at least a touchdown. Oh, geez, I, the injury thing is, is the big, what I'm kind of pinning my hopes on. I woke up this week, and I just had a bad feeling about everything. I think all three of these games are going to go against Buffalo, and they miss the playoffs. I, 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 so honestly, I just won the pick segment. God. Thank you, everybody. This is great. I, don't want, I actually don't want to win under these conditions. But I just see, you know, Miami got – We didn't they convince gave you up that – Did we 56, convince you? Did they you? gave up 56 points last week. They're at home. Mm -hmm. They're desperate now because if they lose this game, they got to go to Kansas City, City. for playoffs. If game. the Bills lose this game, they don't make the playoffs. Well, I don't know that yet. And the you one will break, that night? The one break they get is that they play in the last game. Okay, my <laughs> second game then, I got Tampa. Tampa's getting uh, – Tampa's playing at Carolina. If Tampa wins, they're in. So I don't see them not covering five and a half. What's your second game? Uh, I will go with Kansas City. I think they want to get right. They can against the Chargers, even if it's Chargers are favored. I understand this. Uh, I, Kansas City's got to get right, and they've got to get all their weapons together. They do it against the Chargers. It's a tough week to pick games because so many teams don't care. What oh, do you I disagree. There's an easy one to pick. The Texans are only favored by a point and a half against Indianapolis, which I do not understand. I think the Texans are a much better team. I don't think Garner Minshew gets you into the playoffs. I take the Texans, and I like it with the points. You've been saying that all year. Mm -hmm. uh, Greg, uh, again, week 18, a lot of, lot of moving parts, right? You know, I'm looking forward to the Saturday game. I really believe, even though the Ravens are going to sit a bunch of people, I still think the Ravens are going to beat the Steelers. Plus, the Ravens are getting three and a half. So, giving me three and a half, I'm going to go with the Ravens, but I still think they're going to win the game. So, Sunday's game for the Bills and the Bills Mafia is going to be all about winning by more than three and a half, by win winning by less than three and a half, <laughs> so, and I can win. You know, we'll do this again next week with or without the Bills, but what, what, wrap it up for us. I'm looking forward to a much more convincing wing and a performance by the Bills. I think Josh is going to come out. He always plays strong at night. He always plays strong in the national limelight, which this game is. So I'm looking forward to the Bills actually beating the Dolphins handily, and then I am more than happy to buy dinner because I lose. Hey, free dinner. Whoa. Free dinner. All right. All right. I'm getting two Arby sandwiches. <laughs> <laughs> Very good. You hey, can Greg, take him the Arby's and us. Greg, thank you. Uh, enjoy week 18. Enjoy the trip to Miami. We kind of wish we were going too. Go Bills. All righty.